Hey girl, hey, welcome back to the channel. Tonight we're just going to be talking about long lasting perfumes. I wanted to share with you guys the one I have in my collection, ranging from lowest in price to a little bit more pricey. But if you're looking to start your collection and you're looking for long lasting, I've got some for you. Let's go ahead and get into the video. The first one I wanted to share with you is the least expensive, and that is Pink Sugar by Aqualina. You guys see the dent? This was super affordable. Definitely under $30. When I purchased this bottle, it was probably close to $25. But yes, y'all see the dent? And it's a nice size bottle. Um, I wear it often. But this will last me all day. It's basically just sugar. It's just like a sugar sweet note. Most people have this. But it's definitely long lasting. If you're looking for something that you don't have to just keep reapplying. And it's going to give you that sweet note all day. For the price, you can't beat it. Next up, we're going to go to Armoff Club D. Nuit Woman. You guys, this is a beast of a fragrance and it is so beautiful, citrus, and it is almost, it's leaning unisex, but it's gorgeous, okay? And it's going to last you all day without having to refresh. And that's just it and that's that. It's a gorgeous fragrance. And I got this on Amazon at the time. I, I know it was under $40, but very inexpensive, very affordable, and it's beautiful. Next up is Casablanca. You guys, I've had these perfumes for a minute. And I can't really say. I know when I purchased this, it was about $25. I know the price went up and then it got to where it was unavailable. This is another beast. Now, I will say I wear this one mostly in the winter. But it's a really pretty caramel, apple, grape fragrance. It can be a bit cloying. I would not wear this in the summer. But in the winter, this is perfect for layering. And honey, you will not have to refresh. The next day, you will still smell like Casablanca. So if you're looking for a long-lasting one, this is your girl. I'm just going to run right through these, you guys. Because I'm not going to make... Oops. <laughs> I don't want to make a long video. And I really don't want to edit. So I may edit this out and I may not. Rebel Fleur by Rihanna. Girl. This this honey right here will last you all day for the price and this is an old one this is not new you, you know this has been around a while i probably this is probably like my fifth or sixth bottle of this fragrance i've been wearing this for forever ever since it came out it has always been a beast and it lasts so long it's super pretty super affordable you know just i can't say anything bad about it rebel fleur now moving right along you guys know what this is Lavia Bell when I don't wear her like I should what's wrong with me <laughs> what is wrong with me y'all because every time I wear this I get so many compliments and people already know what it is everybody's like this look be a bill the same from Bath and Body Works I don't wear that either because it smells just like it it just smells a little bit mature. Although I'm mature, I don't really wear mature perfumes. I'm more into the sweets and candies and vibrance and livelies. And this is just like, eh, to me. So if y'all have a good layering combo for this one, let me know. But honey, she will last you all day. I know that. I know that much. She's going to last all day. Livia Bell. I wore this one today. Baby. Why well, say all day long? all day long i can still smell it on me <laughs> i love this fragrance this is billy eilish number two it's definitely woodsy it's definitely aromatic it's got that palo Santo vibe it's giving all that i love it it's almost it could lean masculine a little bit i don't think it does but some women may see it that way I don't know because it's Palo Santo, but I love Palo Santo. It's just fresh and clean to me. And yeah, I had a nice little combo I wore with this. And it's giving. And I can still smell it. And I love it. And that's Billie Eilish number two. Next up, Rosie. This is Dulce by Rosie Jane. Y'all, 
when I tell you, just spray a little bit on this on your clothes, you will still smell it the next day. When I say this is the ultimate chocolate and vanilla fragrance, and my juice is also turning a little bit yellow now. It used to be so clear, and it's definitely changing in color. And I have to say, these are a little bit more mid-range. These last couple ones that I showed you, these aren't necessarily cheapies, but they're not necessarily necessarily high dollar either they're they're affordable but you know a little bit more i don't know 70 80 dollars something like that but i love this fragrance still saved by rosie chain now this one was affordable i really should have put this one earlier i think i got this for around 40 dollars but versace crystal noir i literally smell this on my skin all day all day long no refreshing it's really pretty to me it's a little bit unique it's different it has a little spiciness to it but yep it's really pretty and this lasts me longer than yellow diamond it lasts me young longer than um, bright crystal as well so this is the longest lasting one of the three that i have it's very pretty okay you guys these next ones i'm going to put together Prada Paradox Intense as well as Prada Paradox. Oh girl, I do not like that dent, honey. I'm not feeling that dent, girl. But anyway, I know you can refill this, but these two, especially the Intense, is really long lasting. Both of these last, but I would say the Intense last totally all day and the next day. You'll still smell this on you. Um, so I don't know if you're looking for something uh, very long lasting. Either one of these will do, but this one is really going to get the job done. Okay, moving right along. My blood signature. This is one, honey, if you smell, if you put this on your clothes, on your skin, as well as your clothes, you will smell this all day long. And I love it. I don't know how much this is now. I purchased mine for around $45, but I know some of my friends, they wanted to get it because they liked the way that it smelled, but they said it was too much. The price was like high. I don't know where they were looking. I don't know how much it is now because I've had this bottle. I'm going on a year and a half or something like that, but I don't know. I, I just love it. I don't wear it all the time because I love it, but yep, yeah, it's amazing to me. You have to try it. This is a super fresh one too. Fresh vanilla. Okay, moving right along. This is a cheapy, but honey, from what the girlies are saying, this lasts longer. This is Bach Barracat Gentle Gold. And this is a do for gentle fluidity gold. All right, so well, from what I'm hearing, this lasts longer than gentle fluidity gold. I don't know. I don't have gentle fluidity go, but this is what the people are saying. They're saying it smells just like it, but this lasts longer. And honey, I can smell this all day on me. And this is such a pretty, pretty fragrance for the price. Okay. Long lasting all day for me. Okay. I'm just sliding them out the way. Okay. You guys, Ambrosia Imperial, definitely all day long. The whole entire day and the next day. <laughs> I mean, this is going to be on you until you bathe it off. And I love it. I love the fragrance. It is so beautiful. I can't wait to do some more summer combos with this. But, yep, Navitus, Ambrosia, Imperial. All right, this may be a shocker to some of you. I don't even wear this one because it's kind of like La Via Belle to me. Maybe it's a little bit too serious. I've had this one for a while and my dent is not very big. I really wear more in the winter, but this is a Tresor La Nuit. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly, but it's a beautiful fragrance, but I just don't wear it. But it is really pretty and I want to keep it. I love the bottle. I like everything about it. But baby, when I tell you this will last, this is long lasting. If you're looking for long lasting, there's another one for you. Okay, friend. Ooh, 
This is my bun number nine, Chinatown. Now, I have another bun number nine. It lasts long, too. But this is the one I wear the most because I, I just love this one. The other one, this is Chinatown. The other one, which one is that? I don't know. Sometimes it can hit me wrong and sometimes it smells amazing. I don't know about the other one, but I have, I think it's Bryant Park. Yeah, I don't even know if they even sell that one anymore. But the it's it's very iffy. Some days I love it, some days I don't like it. But this China towel, it is always on point. It's going to last me the whole day. I will smell amazing and mysterious, and it's so pretty to me. Love it, love it, love it. And last but not least, Delena. Girl, I really want me some more Demarley perfumes because they are super long lasting do you hear me when i say long lasting and projecting i see why so many people love it i love the marley because it's it's you're paying honey you're gonna pay but your your quality is definitely there as I really just wanted to come on here really quickly, I just thought about this video idea. And while I have time, I'm like, let me go ahead and film it. So I could just show the girlies some of my most long lasting perfumes. If you're into long lasting, these are some for you to pick from. So leave me a comment down below. Let me know what are some of your most favorite long lasting perfumes. So we'll share. And for people who want only long lasting, beautiful fragrances they can have the opportunity to you know save their coin honey because they know already that it's going to last i hope you enjoyed the video leave me a yellow heart let me know you made it all the way through to the end and i'll catch you in the next one take care